Welcome back everyone. Got a new graphics card, the GTX 670. Not sure it runs all that well with this game though. No, this is a 2009 game, it wasn't properly... Well, obviously it's not properly optimized for a graphics card which only came out recently. Well, let's see how it runs. Zombies. On it. Pulling back because I'm gonna have to deal with an arcane horror in that room. And I'd rather do that without having to face the zombie or comes the arcane horror. Paralyzed failed. Right. Or did it? Zombies. Oh, you are fighting. You are not a lesser Lyrium potion. Not going to pick that up. Nor that. In fact, I don't see the purpose of blank while I'm in the game. So if there's an Just item in the game, it should have a ritual. purpose. Curiosity unchecked became greed for this unfortunate apprentice. What the scroll tells you is uh, that an apprentice was trying to experiment by clicking these statues in a certain order. The ball is first, then the sword up, then the sword down. Then you have to find a fourth hidden statue that's uh, I think it's either um, this should be easy enough behind us or in front of us somewhere in the room right I'll see not gonna bother with that okay Well, isn't that great? I don't need no bolts because I'm not gonna use crossbows. Well, I'm actually... What now? 
If I find a good crossbow, I might give Leliana enough strength to actually use one, but crossbows have a strength mod of fire. Yes, they do have better piercing, but it's kind of stupid though, really. I mean, realistically, it takes more strength to actually use a bow than it is to use a crossbow. And yes, I'm serious about that. I mean, you think drawing a bow is easy? Try it. You'll see how easy it is. Especially a longbow. Run. Not gonna give him the shield. Since uh, the one he has right now is actually better in my perspective. As in, this is his current shield, ha Havard's Aegis. It uh, has the same defense, um, fatigue, and missile deflection, blah blah. No, actually, yeah, same. Uh, the Templar shield gives more armor, but the one I have has a chance to avoid missile attacks and has spell resistance. So obviously the one I have right now is better. Okay, an injury kit. Next room. Let's just equip the Templar helmet. Hmm. Right. I spend. Gonna have to get rid of some items. Let me just see here. Like this dagger. Um. Still helmet. Try it. I shall do it. Hmm. Here. Ah. Yes. Focus on the desire demon. Ah, shit. I'm here. 
Yeah. No shit to run. Well, I did it. And I have a Templar set, a full Templar set. So the fade section comes next. I installed the skip the fade add-on. One thing I have to say about this add-on, the person who made it, made it because he was having trouble actually getting past the section and I have to ask, are people just dumbasses or are pre they are pretending to be dumbasses? Because that section is actually easy to deal with. Oh yeah, it's a puzzle. You have to think. God forbid you have to actually think in a video game once in a while. Or actually in general. Anyway. The Fade is a tiresome section, but it's not difficult in terms of puzzles. It's actually quite easy. But I'm gonna skip it just because I can't be bothered spending an hour going through that entire section. On my own. Anyway, Costine here, signing out.